A very important thing that I would like to look uh, at now uh, will be a trade. Remember that trade um, is a, a tertiary activity. Very important. Okay, now let's have a look at, 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 at trade. Now, firstly, people, what you must remember is uh, that trade, the definition of trade. Trade is when a country sells goods to other country and buys what it needs from other countries. Just like to repeat that, you must know the definition. What is trade? Trade is when a country sells the goods, of course, the surplus goods that, that, that he has, sells it to other countries and buys what it needs uh, from other countries. Obviously, all countries can't uh, produce everything uh, that they need. Now, what is very important, people, is that you must know this uh, concept as well. A balance of payments. What is the balance of payments? It's a statement in which a country's transactions with the rest of the countries are indicated. Now, uh, people just remember, this works just like um, an ordinary account that your, that, uh, that your parents have. Uh, I mean, if they, if, if they go buy you some clothes and they go to, to, to a shop or what, a clothing shop or whatever, uh, they buy your jacket, they buy your shirt, a pair of trousers, shoes or, 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 or whatever, uh, at the end of the month, uh, they're going to re receive a statement from uh, 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 whatever sh uh, uh, clothing shop you have been and, they would, uh, uh, and on that, on, on that uh, account would be shoes so much, your shirt so much and so forth and so forth and so forth. So your balance of payments is exactly the same thing, the statement in which the country's transactions uh, with other countries um, uh, are indicated. What's very important is that you must know when you are busy uh, 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 trading with other countries, there are two very important things, imports and exports. And please, people, these are uh, very easy terms. It's concepts that you have, that, uh, that's familiar for you with, 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 uh, uh, for quite a few, few, few years, but still people can, uh, can define it or really don't know uh, what it's all about. Remember that imports, very important, imports has to do with goods, brought into a country. And export has to do with goods that has been sent out of a country. Remember, imports in, in, brought into the country, exports out of the country. Okay, so every country imports and exports. Right. Now, that import and exports, a very uh, uh, important another concept has to do with the concept regarding balance of trade. Now, what is balance of trade? Balance of trade is your exports minus your imports. In other words, the, the amount of money that you have earned when you exported things minus the amount of money that you have paid to other countries when you had to import things. Now, you can see that this is very, very important here. Because this, this works like, your, like your, your salary that you receive at the, at the end of the month. If you pay too much at the end of the month with your salary, then you're going to have nothing left. You're going to have a minus. And if you can save, I mean, you pay less out, it means you're going to have more money left. And this is exactly what's, what, what, what's, what's happening here. Let's have a look at your balance of trade. Now, here we've got uh, two years in which South Africa has imported and exported goods. Now... Let's have a look at these years, in 1982 and 1983. And now you must, you must follow me, you must stick to, you must understand what's happening here. Let's have a look what happened in 1982. In 1982, the exports were 19,290 million. Now people, can I just get back to that, please? You know, in the exams, usually people, when you are confronted with these statistics, then they ask you a simple question like, what was the amount of exports in 1982 for South Africa? And then you would write 19,290 rand. Please, people, remember if you look at this, if you look at your table here, these exports are in million. In other words, if they ask you in the exams, what was the amount of exports for 1982? Your answer should be 19,290 Million. Please, people, you, you, you're not going to believe me if I tell you how many people make these mistakes in, in, the, in, in the exams. And you're not going to get marks if you make those mistakes. Okay, so let's have a look at the imports for 1982. 20,079 uh, million. Now, 
If you compare the two with each other, now remember, your balance of trades is your exports minus your imports. And the first thing that you should notice here is that your exports, 19,000, but your, uh, your imports, 20,000 and 79 million. In other words, what we've got here, we've got a larger amount that was imported than that was exported. In other words, in 1982, South Africa had to pay more money on their imports than they earned with their exports. Now, what we've got here now in 1982 is that we've got a negative balance of trade. Now, why have we got a negative balance of trade? We've got a negative balance of trade here because our imports were much more than our exports. All right, let's see what's happening in 1983. In 1983, our exports, 2,708 million. Compare this with our imports, 17,545 million. Now immediately you see that now the situation is reversed if you compare that with 1982. Because here we've got 20, here we've got 17. In other words, we will have a total income, a balance of plus 3,163 million. So if we have that situation, then we are in a positive balance of trade. And the reason why we have a a positive uh, a balance of trade is people because we have earned more money uh, 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 in our exports than we paid out for our imp uh, imp imp imports. And this is the situation where countries would like to be in. Exporting more and making money by means of the trade than having to import and import uh, uh, lots of goods. So people, just let, let's have a look at this again because this is very important. You must know that your imports and your exports are very important. And with your, regarding your imports and exports, there's a very important concept called balance of trade. What is your balance of trade? It's your exports minus your, your imports. What must you know? When I get a negative in, uh, 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 balance of trade, then it means that I've spent too much money. In other words, I, I've imported more than uh, and the amount that I've exported. But if we compare that to 1983, then we've got 20, uh, 1,709, which is much more than the 17, uh, 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 1,545 million that we've got here. And then we've got a positive, a very positive uh, 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 balance of trade. Now, people, uh, now what's very important is that they, 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 they love to ask you in the exam, what did South Africa do to change, to rectify the negative balance of trade? Now, let's have a look. There's quite a few things you can do. The first thing that you should do is that you should export more goods. Because if you export more goods, you're going to earn more money. So that's the first thing that you can do if, if, if you want to uh, reverse a negative balance of trade. The second thing that you can do is that you must import less. Because if you import less, you're going to pay less. Uh, your, your expenditure is going to be less. So then you will have... Uh, um, a positive a balance of trade. But one very important thing that South Africa also does is that South Africa also exports more gold and South Africa actually uses the gold to balance uh, uh, the imports and the export. So people, this is very important. You must know your concepts. You must know what is a positive. You must know what's a negative one, uh, 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 um, balance of trade. And please, people, when they ask you an exam, don't forget to add the million rand at the end of your, of your answer.